Hey miners, Mining King here. Today, we're going to be taking a look at how to set up our Helium Miner and a mistake I made, so that way you guys don't have to make the same mistake. So, let's get right into it. Alright guys, before we get into the video, if you could please like, share, and subscribe, I really appreciate it. As well as, I did receive a little package here, which I did tape off this, uh, the letter here so you don't get the addresses and everything like that. But I did get a package from my buddy D-Miners here. So, uh, let's go ahead and crack it open. Oh man, no way. That's super cool. So we got a, we got some stickers from, uh, from D-Miners here. As well as... A holographic Yeti sticker that's really cool I like this one too the uh, it's kind of like a mat this is actually uh, this is actually really cool I like this hey man thanks D miners and uh, I'm gonna be sending you back some mining King stickers all right guys so let's get back to the video all right so I recently just did a video um, on how to upgrade your SD card you know and I was kind of thinking maybe it was similar to like Hive OS, right? Where you just kind of want to run the latest version, right? Well, that's not the case. <clears throat> so when I initially did the setup, I had started the Helium hotspot with the 64 gig on the first boot and I was having issues with it. So inadvertently, I actually went back to the 32 gigabyte. So I recommend that you do your initial startup with your 32 gigabyte uh, SD card that came with your Helium Miner. And then after it does the initial setup, go ahead and power it down again, and then put the 64 gigs back into it. And so far, um, I'm still waiting for my hotspot to sync. I think it's been two days now. So um, I'm still in the syncing phase. Um, I have, I believe, four constructed challenges. I don't know what that is, so I'm really, really new to Helium. Let's get into this video and how to set this Helium hotspot miner up. So let's get right into it. All right, guys. So we are in the Helium app, and this is what it'll look like as soon as you download um, the app to either your iPhone or Android phone. If you have an existing account, you obviously want to click on import existing account, and I'm sure it's probably going to ask you for your your 12 word seed phrase. This is where it starts. You need to click create an account, and then it will ask you for the seed phrases. So this is going to be the next screen you get when creating the account. Helium accounts are protected by 12 unique words. Pretty much, it's just like it's. This is also not only this is where you see your miner but this is also where you create your wallet so once again you it's going to generate a 12 word seed phrase you will have to write down the words make sure to keep them in a safe keep them you know somewhere where you keep all your important documents that you don't want other people seeing so this way if you ever you know get a new phone or whatever and you need your seed phrase you need to have it in a safe place so I'm not going to be able to just follow, follow you in this next screen because I don't want you to see my 12 words. Just know that you'll have 12 words and then it will ask you to, to put them back in the correct order that it told you uh, when it made you write them down. So just make sure you pay close attention. When you get to this screen, you want to pick the Rack Wireless Helium Miner and then you will then need to press and hold the button, the little black button on the side next to the power plug. You want to press and hold that for two seconds, and then you want to click on the pair button that you'll be prompted with. Some of these screens I can't follow, follow you along with as I don't want you seeing my important information. So that's just me personally. So um, now once you get your rack wireless miner set up, I will join you in the next screen. So if you, set this up correctly and you should end up on this screen where you will see that you will be syncing as you can see that my hotspot still says it's syncing um, so that's good that means it's connected now when do you get to the syncing stage if you remember in the beginning of the video i did say i had to put in the 32 gigabyte card right so i i got all the way to this step 
with the 32 gigabyte card as soon as it went to syncing i then turned it off and then i replaced the 32 gigabyte card with the 64 megabyte or 64 gigabyte card so that way this is when i did the sd card switch and this is and this is what my screen is currently right now on day two it is still syncing so i have had four constructed challenges from what i'm told that's like me sending out signals to other miners saying hey i'm here and you're waiting for them to respond and that way you get put onto the helium all right guys i hope this video was helpful so be sure to hit that like share and subscribe as well as why don't you guys go check out d d miners i'll leave a link to his channel down below in the description all right guys this is the mining king giving you the most hashes and i'll see you next time